hi beautiful people and welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome my name is anava and i make faith related and medical related videos welcome to another 12 questions video a video series in which i take a medical doctor of different specialties and I ask them 12 questions about the medical field if those are videos that you would like to see more of them please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more without wasting any more time let's get straight into today's video My name is Wadam Linga. Banda is with the married name. <laughs> I'm a third year internal medicine registrar. Oh, okay, so I went to University of Zambia. I was there for seven years, so I graduated in 2017. I knew I always wanted to be a doctor, I think as far back as grade 3. But when I was in grade 7, my mother bought me a book and they showed the first female cardiolo cardiologist and I was like, oh, I can actually do that. But then when I went to medical school, I was like, oh, do I really want to do internal medicine? I was sort of like undecided between internal medicine and infectious diseases. So when I went to my book, during my clinical rotation, I was drawn towards the infectious disease aspect. But then I think after graduating and having worked for I think two or three years, I thought I liked internal medicine more. But I still want to further sub-specialize later on. Who knows, I might just be an ID specialist. <laughs> okay, so if I'm, uh, if I'm on call and I'm in the OPD, uh, usually I see maybe even as much as depending on the day maybe a hundred depending on how busy the day is but it's not it's not like a reoccurring thing but yeah on average sometimes they can be less or even a bit more mm -hmm. but in the in the words sometimes 20 um. yeah One to two times a week, sometimes three, depending on how uh, the numbers are in the department. <laughs> I'm a nerd. <laughs> I'm a nerd. Right now, reading, TV. Yeah, I read anything really, but I'm more of a fantasy kind of person mm -hmm. uh, occasionally sci-fi and mystery okay i read everything romance i read everything as well as the book the pros your brain is constantly active you are always thinking about what it can or cannot be and it keeps you on your toes you don't see the same thing over and over again so you're always seeing something different, something new, something a bit more challenging. And yeah. Ah, uh, the cons. Okay, practicing in the tropics is a bit difficult because internal medicine, you need to have a proper lab. In our setting, we don't have a proper lab. So mm -hmm. you are limited to how many things you can do in order to diagnose your patients. Mm -hmm. So, by the time you're making a concrete uh, diagnosis, your patient might have already passed, which is very unfortunate, it shouldn't be like that. Yeah. But we, we tend to see a higher mortality in our yeah. specialty, so I think that should be the top one. Yeah. And spending many hours in the hospital. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it's fun, so I, anyway, yeah. The majority of the time, the mortality and the long hours just an add-on to that question when you speak of the mortalities a lot of people mention that with medicine what were your thoughts before you entered your specialty like considering the mortalities that you're going to face uh, I, I don't know like initially before I actually even entered medicine internal medicine I always thought that's the thing I'm going to do like regardless of the previous like perceptions from different people uh, I was I was hoping to make a difference. That was like the main reason why I joined internal medicine. Sort of like probably reduce the mortality and 
make it a better department so that more females can join the department. Yeah, like me. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I'm surrounded by a lot of men, so <laughs> majority of them are sort of like type A kind of people that are like, you know, either this way or mm. like, majority of them are type A. Sometimes I feel like being mostly in a man, in a, in a world where you have a lot of men in that space, I think there's a lot of like, um, it's sort of like misunderstood. If you request maybe for certain things that you you should rightly have like in your corner, mm -hmm. sometimes um, it might be taken wrong. So you tend to sort of like overwork to sort of like overly compensate for those perceptions. As much as I can try to fight all those stereotypes. Yeah. That, Unfortunately, it will take some time. Yeah. yeah. So they are still there. There are always those stigmas and stereotypes regarding women in medicine yeah. that we sort of like have to fight almost on a daily basis. Be strong. <laughs> it's it's tough but very rewarding. Mm -hmm. It's one of those specialties where. I think when you make a difference, you actually, you know, you feel it and it's very rewarding.